on the national circuit here at Silverstone for the final race of the Nissan GT Academy 2015. Yeah, look, to be here at Nissan Motorsport, is, uh, it's definitely starting to sink in a little bit that this is going to be my new life. Oh, I'll get to try and get in. <laughs> this is just awesome. Australian Matt Simmons down in the Australian yellow number five car to pull position and they are off and running. It's definitely exciting and I can't wait to just grasp it all and, and, and enjoy the journey. Fastest man on the circuit is still the Australian Matt Simmons. As a gamer, uh, I qualified for Gran Turismo and was able to put a time down to get myself to the Australian GT Nationals. From there, went through challenges to get through to the final six. Matthew Simmons is going to the UK. Come on up, Matthew. Where we're shipped off to the GT International Race Camp at UK, where we went through an extensive week of challenges, of fitness, driving, and I was able to come out on top and become the GT Academy International Champion. Your life is about to change forever. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of the 2015 GT Academy is Matthew Simmons from yeah. Australia. Yeah. From winning GT Academy International, I now move towards the Development Driver Program, where it's an intensive program where they turn me into a professional racer and it finishes my goal of becoming, coming from a gamer uh, to a racer, and I represent Nismo and Nissan on a world scale. The innovation with this whole program is what got me involved, because it's what gets every, every young kid and their dreams, you know, they don't have the upbringing of being able to race in carts and go up the more, I guess, conventional, traditional way. With the involvement of simulators and the involvement of Nissan and PlayStation to make this possible is just a dream. It's just a dream. I'm going from being a postie to a professional race car driver. Uh, it's quite surreal. I never thought that I'd be upgrading from my Curia van to a DDR GT3, uh, which, which a lot of my work colleagues are quite jealous about. Feels natural, like I've always wanted to be here before, but this is surreal. Well, I'm just going to be excited to be able to drive the Nismo DDR GT3 and be able to oh, just I race it as hard as I can and get the best results and definitely wouldn't be any other car I'd, I'd, I'd want to drive as a professional. And getting that as my first seat is going to be unbelievable. You have to earn your, earn your way to get to this point. I'll give absolutely everything to be in this seat one day. Oh, 